All right, I'm gonna share five things you can do in a lucid dream to stabilize it once you've actually already become lucid. And uh, this video, we're just gonna walk around this, what I think is a lake, but it could also be an ice rink in the winter. So, number one, uh, meditate or gather chi energy. Walk around and don't close your eyes because let's face it, if you close your eyes as soon as you become lucid, what's gonna happen? You're gonna wake up. So don't close your eyes, but just with open eyes, stare at a fixed point and just imagine or visualize or expect that you're gonna gather this energy. Almost like you're meditating, and if you've meditated in real life, you'll know what that feels like, but you're doing it in a dream. So it's like you're trying to gather this energy in uh, the dreaming state. Number two, do a reality check as soon as you become lucid. Now, the chances are, if you've become lucid, the chances are you've already done a reality check and that's what has made you lucid, right? But you should still do another reality check just to be extra sure and just to solidify that lucidity and make sure that you're gonna stay in the dream for, for longer, okay? Number three, tell yourself, uh, either out loud or in your head, I will make this lucid dream last longer. This does a few things. This engages the subconscious mind. It affirms to yourself that you what, about what you're gonna do, so it you know, t becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy. You tell yourself, I will stay lucid longer, so you actually end up doing that. And like I said, it engages the subconscious. Your dream, your dreaming mind is a very powerful thing, and uh, dream commands are something which I've talked about a lot in the past, but basically all they are, all you're doing, is uh, telling your subconscious mind what you want by saying literally, I want the dream to be more clear. A wasp just flew right into my head. I want the dream to be more clear. And so the subconscious mind responds by doing that. Uh, and very, very simple hack. Number four, find your dream guide. A dream guide is a character, a dream character that your subconscious mind creates specifically to help you navigate through the dream. This can be a person, humanoid, it can be an energy, it could even just be an animal. But the point is that once you find this dream guide, it will, or the, they will, seriously help you uh, become more lucid, navigate through the dream, you find you know exactly where you're going to want to go, and uh, yeah, it becomes a very easy hack. And number five, subscribe to this channel, leave a like, leave a comment, and uh, that's actually super important for all of these techniques and anything relating to lucid dreaming. Okay, so do that, do those five things, you will, as, and do them as soon as you become lucid. The lucid state will last longer and uh, you'll find the whole thing 10 times easier. But make sure to subscribe, done. Thanks for watching guys. This video and this channel are supported by my Patreon followers. Please consider giving just a dollar a month to support this channel or just click the links in the description and you'll find links to various Lucid Dreaming products, articles, techniques and tutorials. If you did enjoy this video, please click the notification bell and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Why are you still watching this? You should have clicked one of my related videos by now, right? Or subscribed or gone onto my website or something like that.